It's been a long road to the Cannes Film Festival for Egyptian-Austrian filmmaker A.B. Shaki and his feature debut Yomadine. The Feel Good Road movie was a passion project that he developed as his thesis out of NYU's Tisch School for the Arts, shot in Egypt with his wife, first-time producer Dina Emim, and stars non-actors with no reading or memorizing skills. The challenge landed him rejections from some festivals before Can offered an uncertain regard slot and then bumped him up to competition, a rare birth for a neophyte. Shaki, who moved to Cairo at 25, set up indie production company Desert Highway Pictures with MM to make Yomadine, but didn't know anybody in the industry. It was a huge endeavor and a risky project for a first-time filmmaker, he says. He returned to New York for post, and stopped when he ran out of money, taking a job as a consultant on Hulu's The Looming Tower in the interim. It was when Egypt's film clinic boarded that things picked up momentum. Yomadine is the story of a Coptic leper and his orphaned apprentice who leave the leper colony and embark on a journey to search for what is left of their families. Shaki had previously made a documentary short about the leper colony. Hearing stories of how families would abandon their children there and never return, he was inspired to make a feature. His lead actor Rady Gamal is a member of the real leper colony Shaki had visited years earlier. He was phenomenal. This is his story in a way. The subject matter is heavy, Shaki allows. But films from the Middle East usually have to be political and make a statement. This is just a feel-good movie. He will continue to go where the stories take him. This one is set in Egypt because it's a good story. The bigger goal is to tell stories that get through to audiences regardless of background.